Three, here we go. So this is a very practical focus type of uh, discussion in a way because it's based on the programs that uh, the organization that I'm working with uh, is facing. We promote uh, social and financial education to children and youth and we empower them to be an active uh, and engaged citizen in their uh, community. We, uh, one of the modules is dis to discuss about uh, understanding about their rights and their rights in the community for example and what uh, we would like from them is that to also share all of these uh, thoughts, aspirations and stories and even projects that they do in the community around uh, uh, creating awareness for example and uh, projects that, uh, that, that they do. Um, one of the uh, challenges around this is that because we push uh, third-party data, uh, data of youth age 14 and above, there are concern from our implementing partners around the safety of this information, how we as an organization will be using this information and also that all of these stories are uh, open for public to see. And um, there's a couple of situational uh, concern uh, in certain countries who are uh, in a conflict situation, for example, they would like to uh, be part of the program that we do because they feel that it's good to be in, to empower young people uh, to think about these uh, social issues in the community. But um, they are worried that all of these data might have uh, implication once these youth are entering their workforce because of their employee might be able to track down all of these. Uh, uh, campaign awareness projects that they do in the community. So um, it's it's all around, it's kind of like the pro problem stems around these issues and uh, I've been getting a lot of practical advice that uh, one thing that we can do is uh, to also train our facilitators and teachers in the country to, um, to be able to uh, translate all of these stories in a safe uh, format in a way and also to have an additional modules uh, on the online platform for the youth to be able to create a safe enough um, uh, stories and videos that will not be damaging to their futures uh, without uh, diluting the essence of that critical thinking and right-based uh, approach. Uh, that they would like to put forward in the community. Okay, thanks very much. Big round of applause for you.